Pilipinas at buong mundo na itay kapuso. Pahiram po ng 20 minutes ng inyong hapon. Ako po si Boy and welcome to Fast Talk with Boy Abunda. Wala po si Chang Susan pero narito po si Chang. <laughs> Andito po si Chang Tracy kasama ho namin ngayong hapon. Ang bisita po natin ngayong hapon is a power couple who uses a power to inspire, to motivate, to love, and uh, celebrating the 30 years, they have this wonderful book called Marriage is a Marathon. And uh, para sa mga nanay at tatay at kapuso at mga bagets na nagmamasid ho sa atin ngayong hapon, they're also proud parents. So, uh, let me see if I would get it. Uh, Solana, uh, Ella, Hannah, Benjamin, and of course, a young superstar. He's one of my favorites. And I'm talking about Donny Pangilinan. My balita na naririnig ako, I don't, I don't know if it's in the book. Uh, alam niyo ba na naghuhugas ng plato sa bahay si Donny Pangilinan? But let me introduce to you uh, our guest, uh, the lovely couple, Anthony and Maricel Pangilinan. Hi, hi, hi. Thank you. Maraming salamat. Thank you. I'm happy to have you here on the show. I know, thank you. Kagabi, I was browsing through this, but congratulations. Thank you. Thank you. You have to get a copy of this book. Kailangan, kailangan. Totoo na guhugas ang plato si Donny? Yes, of course. Talaga? Every Saturday. Every Saturday kasi walang ano, walang yaya day. Okay. So pag dumating yan sa bahay ng Sabado, no choice siya. Pwede siya magluto. Pwede siya maghugas, yeah. pwede siya magwalis. But you have to be part of the chores for that day. Uh, and you're also talking about, you know, in fairness, like, I, I know Ella is is getting married this yes. year. Oh, yeah. She's she a personality. She's a social media personality herself. So sa bahay, walang, walang uh, superstar, wala. superstar. Basta nasa bahay, walang pinag-uusapan na status kahit saan. Lahat tayo pantay-pantay na mga anak sila, kami yung mga magulang. Lahat na kami. Kasama kami sa church. <laughs> Kasama, walang, walang. Ever since. Uh, okay. Alright. Let's, let's go to the book. Uh, ba- bakit tinawag niyo ito na marathon? Well. Ang <laughs> uh, tag. Ang tagal. Ang haba. <laughs> well, ang haba ng ginugol also, na panahon. Oh my gosh. Yes. It talks about the marathons we've run around the world. 17 in all in all. Yes. Including yours. 11 and tama, six, six. Yes. Oh, tama. So, marami kaming lessons na natutunan doon, preparing, racing, recovering. And naisip namin, apa, lahat ng mga lessons na to, pwede sa mag-asawa, pwede sa buhay, kahit single ka man, o may asawa, or, you know, you're a student, kahit kanino pwede, kasi Actually, disiplina ang kailangan. Na, yes. It was ano, your you idea. know, dito po, it's just hit me right now. <laughs> kahit yung mga seminars ko, sabi na, Anthony, Han, ba't di natin gawing pang-pamilya? Yung mga tinuturo mo dyan sa kumpanya, dapat sa bahay din, dapat sa, yeah. sa mga hihaya din, dapat. So, ito, it was your idea. Yung pagtakbo namin ng marathon, i-relate ka natin sa marriage. Saan namin makukuha ang libro? Nagmamasid si nanay at tatay yeah. at sabi, saan ba namin ma- na- mabibili yan? Anthonyandmaricel.com and Lazada and Shopee. Okay. Online, online. Chapter 1 is your favorite. Yes. Make the decision. But mm-hmm. I know we can discuss the whole chapter. But I want to go... Uh, doon ang mismo sa punto hmm. na he wanted to quit. Gusto niyang maghiwalay. <laughs> Umpisa pa lang. <laughs> uh, Umpisa pa lamang. Sabi ko, wow, what a way to start. And it was you yes. who, you know, who said, uh, if it doesn't work, uh, because of that predisposition that you had na pag hindi nag-work ang isang relasyon, eh, go, walk I away. I think pag uh, lumaki ka sa isang tahanan na may single parent ka, survivor ka, so when you see something not working, wag natin pilitin magkasundo na lang tayong maging magkaibigan. Tapos, let's move on. That was your mindset. Yes. That was a predisposition you mm-hmm. had because you were raised by a lovely single mother. Yes. Okay, so, pagdating ng marriage, anong nangyari? O, syempre, marami kaming natuklasan about each other na mga little things lang, pero things that would annoy you. Katulad? <laughs> ano ba? <laughs> Alam mo, problema kasi Sometimes kay Maricel, I don't even remember. nag-adjust sa akin yan para, para magkasama kami. Mm-hmm. No, it was her. I don't think you did it consciously. Mm. Na, alam mo, outgoing ako. Naging outgoing din siya. May mga kaibigan ako. Kinaibigan din niya lahat. Pero nag-asawa kami. 
yung pala, hindi pala sa ganun. Introvert pala ako. Ayaw pala okay. niya yung maraming kaibigan. <laughs> ayaw pala niya yung mga labas. Ay, so, complete change yung personality. Yeah, But you appreciated that because, the, you know, I, I love it when you say in the book, intentional. Yes. Because your intention was, you know, basically uh, to discover, to please. Mm -hmm. Diba? Oh. Naligawan ako. Parang <laughs> <laughs> okay, so, what happened? I think the mindset na alam mo nang this is the one and you want to make it work right. without really thinking about it, parang I was adjusting to him. And then later on, I realized ko hindi pala ako yun. Iba pala ako. Tapos nung napapansin niya na hindi ako masyadong excited lumabas or excited na maraming tao, Nagtataka siya bakit? Ano nang bago? Ano nangyari? Okay. So, how did you manage that? I mean, in within the marriage. Yeah, we got a lot of help from a lot of people. Parang marathon yan. Kailangan mo ng coach, uh -huh. mentor, kailangan mo yung pumapalakpaka sa sidelines. Otherwise, you will mm -hmm. quit. Yes. And you make a decision. You make a decision when you get married, di ba? Pag wedding day. Pero araw-araw pala kailangan mag-desisyon ka. Talk, talk, talk about it. So you make a decision, and that decision, you stand by that decision. But that does that decision evolve? Uh, nagbabago ba yung decision na Lumalalim. Yun? Lumalalim. Oo, oh, lumalalim. Ito pala ibig sabihin ng decision ko. Oh, hindi ko alam. My God. <laughs> hindi lang pala siya yung napangasawa ko. Buong pamilya pala, o mga kapatid pala, ganyan. So I, I, this is the experience of everybody. We make decisions. Sabi nila, Madali yung decision making, yung decision management Men. yung tayo na irata. Right. Diba? Uh -oh. And so, even today, we still And you have decide. to raise four children in five years. <laughs> di, di, di ba? I oh. mean, uh, bahagi yung Pero okay. lahat ng bagay kasi na nangyayari sa mag-asawa, pagka all at the same time nangyayari, nakaka-stress yun. Alam, alam niyo ba yun, Tito Boy, that good experiences, kahit na napakaganda niyan, pagsabay-sabay, ikasi stress mo. Can overwhelm. Di ba? Yeah. So, ang daming mga, ang daming namin kaibigan na new house, na, na promote, nagbakasyon, tapos nangutang para tapos kung ano ma. Tapos nagkaanak. Nagkaanak. And then, ang ganda sana lahat nun, but in one year, they separated. Pero kayong dalawa, uh, dumating din ba sa punto ng inyong marriage na nawalang kayo ng pera that you went through oh tough, gosh. rough yes, times? Yes. Meron din? Yes. There have been times. Kapon. <laughs> <laughs> no, let's go. <laughs> Let's go to chapter three, which is reviewing, you know, the route. Mm -mm. Yes, uh, yes. Specifically, let's talk about the honeymoon. Honeymoon pa lang, <laughs> nagbabangayan na kayo, <laughs> nag-aaway na kayo. W what happened? Okay, okay. Kasi nangyari dito, nung ikakasal na kami, we decided to go through counseling. Lumabas lahat ang problema. Na hindi namin nakita. When we got engaged... Oh my God, ito pala yung mapapangasawa ko. Ganito pala siya, ganito pala ako. So by the time we got into our wedding honeymoon, lumahalabas na lahat yung mga issue na yeah, hindi namin... Yeah, we were very much aware. You get it? Was... You get it? Yes, so, I, I, I do. So we were in the middle of discussing major issues about money, family, sex, you know, everything else. Eh, tapos ang dami pang press natin kasama sa honeymoon Kasi namin. Kasi naman... sponsored yung aming honeymoon. <laughs> <laughs> so ang dami namin press, hindi ko lang kasama. <laughs> Eh, paano ko nag-aaway kayo? Hindi ba tayo sa kwarto doon? There was, a there was a change story na doon ka, dito ako? Yes. Oh my God. So, sa harap ng press, syempre, best foot forward kami. Right. Tapos, pag umalis sila, pagod na pagod na kami. Tapos, kailangan Man. namin mag-usap. Kailangan uh -huh. namin mag-honeymoon. So, parang, <laughs> oh my God. So, minsan nagbabiyahe kami, di ba, sa MRT. Merong yeah. dalawang areas yun eh. Doon ka sa kabila, ako dito sa kabila, naghiwalay talaga kami ng landas. So when you say, when you say review the route, it's a marathon. In a marathon, may mga races na na maraming bridges na okay. kailangan umikot dito, may pababa, magrelax ka. So ganon din sa marriage, de ba? You have to you have to talk to people who okay. have been married before you, because hmm. may rota yan, eh. merong okay. norming stage, may performing stage, may mga ganon, may storming stage. Pag wala kang idea ng rota ng marriage, masasak ka. You will not you can't anticipate. Di mo ma You know, you cannot prepare for it. So, so ask advice from those who have gone before you. Tama. Ano ba ang mga stages ng isang ikinakasal? Mawawala ka, mapapagod ka. Ayun, oh, gusto mo mag-quit dito. Yun Kasi na. feeling mo, ikaw lang. Yung pala lahat right. kaya gusto mag-quit, you know? So, uh -huh. 
So the thought of quitting is everybody's experience, even That's in marriage. Right. But know? not here on Fast Talk, no. because we're going to do it. Okay? <laughs> we're going to do Fast Talk, Anthony. Okay. Take it. <laughs> Maricel, Maricel. And our time begins now. Happiest time at home? When we're all together eating. Maricel, happiest time with Anthony? In bed. <laughs> <laughs> anak mong, I'll, I'll go back to that. Anak mong, anak mong manang mana kay Anthony? Si Hana. Complete the sentence. Ang sexy ni Anthony kapag? Natutulog. <laughs> I feel sexy when Anthony... Takes off his shoes. <laughs> Maricel, naini si Anthony sa akin twin? Ang tagal ko sa banyo. <laughs> Sino ang mas wapo? Ikaw, Anthony, o si Donnie? Si Anthony. <laughs> <laughs> mas simpatiko. Ah... Uh, Si Dolly? <laughs> agree, agree. Anthony, uh, anak mong manang-mana kay Maricel? Dolly. Sa inyo ni Maricel, sinong unang nangangalabit? Depende sa kondisyon, di ba? <laughs> Kami dalawa. Okay. Depende sa oras, depende sa sitwasyon. The last time. Ako. <laughs> Anthony, sino ang, well, mas under? In the relationship, I'm not talking about. <laughs> sa pera ako, sa plano siya. Okay. Anthony, sino mas madalas magselos? Both. Lights on or lights off? Dimmed. <laughs> happiness or chocolates? Happiness. Happiness. Best time for happiness? Anytime. Anytime. What is your prayer for each other? Oh, my prayer for Maricel is that she will continue to trust that God is working on me because I'm, uh, after 30 years, still a work in progress. Mm. And I'm committed to being the best that I can be over time. So, yun lang, yun lang. Nasaan ang maniwala sa na tinatrabaho niya ako at right. mababago pa rin ako. Maricel, ikaw. Pa ako ang prayer ko lang kay Anthony na maniwala siyang we're all behind him and naniniwala kami sa mga ginagawa niya. Kahit minsan nakaka-loka yung mga <laughs> ideas niya but uh, we're all behind him and that if he just trusts in, he continues to trust in the Lord, it will be well. All will be well. You know, when we come back, I want to talk to you about a couple of things. One, uh, hindi makakaila that uh, Donnie, Pangilinan, ang inyong anak, is one of the hottest young actors in the industry today. Uh, gaano kalaki ang inyong pakialam? Number two, I want to go to chapter five. I think this is one of the most, your favorite, one of the most powerful chapters in the book. The story about Benjamin, uh, who was about to go under the knife, uh, open heart surgery, and, you know, you had that change of mind. Uh, let's talk about that. And uh, paano mo, Maricel, napatawad ang iyong ama? Ang mga kasagutan po sa pagbabalik ng Fast Talk with Boy Abundo. Back to the show. Fast shoutouts. Alan Libuano ng Pateros, Melhoma ng Los Angeles, California. Happy birthday, Jennifer Bancosta. Happy birthday, Mina, Carmina Villaruel. And Dr. Manny Kalayan. Sa lahat sa inyo, maraming salamat po. Dahil we're able to do what we do because of your love and support. Maraming maraming salamat. And Boys of La Carmela at the Barakay, thank you. Anthony Marcel, let's talk about Donnie. He's not even emerging. I used to say emerging young. He is. Mm -hmm. You know, he is a young superstar today. Uh, gaano kalaki ang inyong pakialam sa karera ng inyong anak? Meron kaming guidelines. Ito apat lang. We're the win. W, walang plastika. Yan lang reminder namin sa kanya. Just, we make sure that he is true to who he is. Anong ang konteksto yan? Walang plastika. Huwag mo gagawin yung hindi mo gusto, na hindi talaga ikaw na, na, na pinipilit ka lang. You gotta be okay. who you are in every project that you do. Alright. Oh, anong next? Ano? Iisipin. Iisipin ang iba. Dahil? Dahil hindi lang ikaw ang uh, you against the world, kailangan you and me against the world tayo. And then Saka, niya, maging, you make a difference And then he, he, he really makes sure that he is connected with his uh, management, with his staff, with his team, di ba? So, okay. Yeah, we're saying this iba. as co-managers. Yeah. And as then co-managers. Yes. Oh. But who has the final say? Does Don, your boy, Don. I'm sorry to say boy, does Donnie... Uh, have the final. Of course, he's 25. Diba? He is. Yes. Yes. Yun, diba? But so, what a good boy. Huhugas ka pala ng plato, Donnie. Ano ba yun? W-I-N. N. Nagbabasa dapat ng kontrata. Yan. 
Basahin mo kontrata mo, yan. alamin mo ang deliverables mo. Hindi namin sasabihin I mean, coming, coming from you and listening as a manager, ang ganda nun, this is oh, yes. the first time I'm hearing this because yeah. it is not easy to read contracts. Pero natututunan po. Alam mo kung bakit why it makes a lot of sense? Ang dami mga talents na hindi ko kasi alam na yun ang pinirmahan ko. Oh, no, oh, yun. No. Yun. Si no, Donnie, alam niya, kontrata, pati um, ilan ang deliverables niya, niya, ilan posts niya, gagawin ba niya itong right. TikTok na to or what have you. Then finally, darating ka ng nasa oras. Yung D. Yeah. So W-I-N-D. Yeah. Walang plastikan, iniisip mo dapat ang iba, nagbabasa ka ng kontrata at darating ka on time. Yun lang. That's it. We just, and the rest, bahala Th- na siya. Thank you. Oh, thank you so much for sh- sharing that with <laughs> us. That's Donnie Pangilinan. Okay, let's go to that story, Chapter 5. Mm-hmm. You're in the U.S., four years old, Benjamin, and sh- he was about to have an open-heart surgery. And you were saying, wag na, umuwi na tayo. Yeah, all of a sudden, I had this moment of denial. Now, there's nothing wrong with my son. Let's just go home. I think it was the fear of losing him. Oh. And then I felt the presence of God just parang pin me down and say, Who are you? He is mine. Tapos, I was humbled kasi, Sino nga ba ako? What do I know? And we wouldn't have gone this far for nothing. Tapos, naalala ko yung story ni Isaac na binigay siya ni Abraham kay Lord kasi hiningi niya. Tapos sabi ko lang, Lord, ibalik mo siya sa akin. Halaga ako siya. Mother's prayer. Yeah. But he said something that yeah. made you decide. It's the first thing he said when he told me first na may problema siya sa puso. Kasi oh. sin- they found out first than me. Right. Said and, and Bench. Mm-hmm. So the first day pa lang na sinabi, sinabi niya sa akin na may problema yung puso niya, tinanong niya ako, Dad, can you fix my heart? Mm. Yeah. And I said, no, Bench, but God who made you can. Mm. And Ben said, then I am the healedest boy of all. Mm. He was four. Yeah. And that night when Maricel was saying, wala siyang sakit, uwi na tayo, hindi matutulito, Ben was the one who brought back our faith. When he said, Mom, Dad, I'm the healedest boy of all. Wow, I wish I have another four hours with you guys. Oh. <laughs> but I want to go to the story. Alam mo, uh, Maricel, you've been very public. I mean, as a movie star, more public than Anthony, actually. <laughs> Pero mas showbiz siya sa akin. Hindi ko alam mo bakit hindi nag-artista ito ang ganyan. But, you know, uh, there was a time, for example, in your story that uh, ipinapakilala ka ng sarili mong tatay sa iyong mga siblings mm. na pinsan. Yeah. How painful was that? At maikli lamang, uh-uh. how did you forgive? Paano ka nagpatawad? Well, una, bata ako noon, tapos nung pinaliwanag niya, hindi maiintindihan na mas nakakabata akong mga kapatid, uh, it made sense to me, but right. masakit pa rin. Tapos, dinala ko pala yon growing up. And then, it was really the efforts of Anthony and the kids who allowed me to heal, slowly heal through time. And it was really uh, days before my dad passed that I realized I didn't need to have to carry any of those burdens. Kasi pala, um, may mga bagay talagang hindi mo mapapaliwanag. And buti na lang dahil nung tinanong niya kami kung may atraso kami sa kanya, nasabi kong buong-buo na wala. So that was a release. And then wow. he passed. Can oh. I just share yung ano? Oh, oh. Yung ayaw niyang puntahan yung tatay niya early on in our marriage. Okay. Pero bawat bisita namin ng mga bata, pag umuwi, parang nakikinig siya. Anong, anong nangyari <laughs> nung bumisita? Ako. Okay. And then finally she said, sama na nga. Okay. Yeah. So it was really the kids. Excitement, seeing their grandfather. Right. That we inspire. Get a copy of Marriage is a Marathon. And even if we are not able to do this, can we just show the clip of Maricel? Because oh. I've been your fan. No, oh. Totoyan, I really think in my heart that you're one of the best, uh, you know, most powerful actors in this country. She's Totoyan. Back. She's back. Yeah, but you tell us here, you have. Yeah. Yeah. Yes, GMA, right GMA, now. Yeah. I know. Right. But you have to watch this as we end this conversation. Can we, can we show it? You're finally here. Kanina pa kita hinihintay, Rosemary. Bumisita ka ba dito para murahin ako at tawagin Boba? Hindi. Papatayin lang kita. What could you have possibly gained from all of this? How low can you go? Baka nakakalimutan mo. You started all of this with you and Jameson getting Kenneth arrested. Oh my God! Oh my God! 
You're finally here. Nandito ka pala, Rosemary. Nandito ka ba para murahin ako o tawagin akong boba? Hindi. Papatayin lang kita. What could you have possibly been thinking? How low can you go? Hmm. Baka nakalimutan mo. It was you and Jameson who had Kenneth arrested. Tawagin mo! Thank you. Thank you very much. Night tayo ka po so. Supportan po natin si Maricel at saka si Anthony. Marriage is a marathon. Uh, get your copy. Um, stay kind. Say thank you. And make, uh, make your nanay and tatay proud. Usap tayo muli. Goodbye for now and God bless. Yeah!